Hello everybody, welcome back to Vegas Sports Talk. And tomorrow it starts with the Golden Knights. It's their first round robin matchup. And they are facing off against the four, the four seed Dallas Stars. The Golden Knights are the three seed. The Stars are 37, 32, and eight. They had 82 points before the season was postponed due to the pandemic. And the Golden Knights were 39, 32, and eight with 86 points prior to the shutdown. The Golden Knights beat the Coyotes in the exhibition game on Thursday. So team stats. The goal fours for the Dallas Stars, 2.58 goals against 2.52. They are not that good of an offensive team. If they are not playing good defense against the Golden Knights tomorrow, the Golden Knights will beat them 4-1 or 4-2 because the Golden Knights will find ways to score. But Dallas has trouble scoring, and if Marc-Andre Fleury played like the way he did on Thursday night, this team won't score against them. Shots per game, 30.6. The power play percentage is 21.1. Penalty kill, 79.7%, which is pretty good. 80% is pretty good for your penalty kill. For the Golden Knights, the goals for 3.15 goals against 2.94. Shots per game, 34.5. So they get, they get off four more shots than the Dallas Stars do. Their power play is 22%. Penalty kill, 76.6%. That number needs to get better if they want to make it farther in the playoffs. And as I was saying during the regular season, during that stretch in January and February, they were not killing up enough penalties. And if they don't kill off their penalties in the playoffs, they'll be out in the first round against a, a qualifying team. And you, you can mark my word on that. The goal time comparison, Bishop 21-16-4, 2.50 goals against a 9.28 percentage. And Kidovin 16-84, 2.22 goals against and a 9.38 percentage. And Cogliano is out for the Dallas Stars, and so for the Vegas Golden Knights is Max Pacioretty. He is injured, but Marc-Andre Fleury, he was 27-16-5, 2.77 goals against a 9.05 save percentage during the regular season, and Robin Leonard, who we acquired from the Chicago Blackhawks at a trade deadline, he was 19-10-5, 2.89 goals against and a 9.20 save percentage. These teams played each other twice in the regular season. The Stars won one game in Dallas, the Golden Knights won the other game, and they were scheduled to play on St. Patrick's Day before the season was shut down, as I said earlier. Their next games, Dallas will play Colorado on the 5th. Colorado won today against the Blues with 0.1 seconds left, so they have two points. St. Louis, they'll play on the 9th. They currently have zero points. The Golden Knights will play St. Louis on the 6th and Colorado next Saturday. So. There you guys go. It's the first round robin game for the Golden Knights. This will just determine seeding, but it is important because the seed because teams get reseeded after every round. So the Golden Knights, if they get the one seed, they could technically play the 12 seed Chicago Blackhawks, and that'd be a really good matchup for the Golden Knights. And I'm not trying to look ahead too soon. They just need to control control business tomorrow against the Dallas Stars, a team they should and probably will beat. But we can never get rid of Dallas Stars. We need to play our toughest tomorrow. We need to make sure that they come out guns blazing. So this game is 3.30 tomorrow night on NBCSN. And there you guys go. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys again real soon.